Hello, thank you for watching this video. I'm Ram Mirwani from Conrad Technologies. Today we're going to give you a short introduction on an application for driver in the loop simulation which also brings in sensor fusion HIR. Uh, this is Byung from InnoSimulation in Korea. Uh, it's very a uh, pleasure to uh, collaborate with three parties. So we just provide that, uh, the driving cockpit and uh, virtual environments. I am Gerd Schmitz from SEA GmbH in Germany. Uh, we are specialists in V2X, GNSS and RF communications. Hello, my name is Xin Chao uh, from National Instruments. Uh, NI offers general and application specific software as well as modular hardware. This software-defined platform is essential in automotive tests so that you test the system can adapt to the new technologies like radar and V2X communications. So Conrad Technologies has been focusing on sensor fusion for the past few years. And what we have over here is really working with Inno Simulation to include sensor fusion HIL into the driver in the loop application. So with the compact driving simulator that we have over here, we have included the radar test system from Conrad Technologies. Now this, the vehicle radar test system here is built on the National Instruments vehicle radar test system application. Um, you can see the millimeter wave radio head that goes from 76 to 82 gigahertz and then is connected to the vector signal transceiver in the PXI platform. Now this black box you see over here is the, the anechoic material, the anechoic chamber that has the radar sensor in it. Now receiving the data from the simulation, from the scanner simulation, the radar test system is able to implement the different object scenarios as needed. Now including together with the radar test system, we also have GPS simulation that's happening at the back end and towards the left hand side we have the V2X communication piece as well. So together with all the different subsystems that will go into a vehicle, we can now do sensor fusion hardware in the loop simulation together with driver in the loop. And that's what this application is showing. In the simulation, we provide the three parties. The driving cockpit, and then AI platform, NVIDIA PX2, and then simulation engine. The simulation engine, we making that uh, Nanjing CT in real database, GPS based. And then traffic simulation, and then uh, virtual sensor. So virtual sensor is gathering the, during the simulation. We send it uh, all the data, uh, I mean that the specific data to that the Conrad, the radar target simulator. So radar target simulator send it back to that uh, some specific uh, data to that uh, NVIDIA PX2. So NVIDIA PX2 is a module that the camera captured dim learning and then the rule based data sensors. And then it's controlled at the steering and then the acceleration deceleration. So we're making that the closed loop simulations. We provide test solutions for V2X communication from RF to full test, full functional test and GNSS. So what you see here is for example part of our full test system including GNSS and here you see a low level part communicating by LTV or 802.11p with some RF analysis and message transfer. Well thank you for watching this video which shows the application of sensor fusion hardware in the loop together with driver in the loop in a closed simulation capability for validating a variety of different subsystem and system level applications related to ADAS testing and autonomous driving capability. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact us at Conrad Technologies or InnoSimulation or National Instruments. We would be very happy to follow up with you. Thank you.